what is going on you guys what's up what it do welcome back for another vlog i guess we could call this like vlogmas day three a lot of you have been asking if i'm doing vlogmas and i am but like in my own way i can't do a vlog every single day um just with the other uploads that i have prepared for you guys and with having christian full-time i couldn't get out like good quality videos but i'm gonna vlog at least like every other day so i'm excited about that so today's video again is all vlog style did i already say what's up and what it do my mind is like going today i'm like running a little late but i thought it'd be another cool day to vlog because i'm going out i'm having a little girls day meeting up with one of my friends um at this really cool shopping center like an hour away we're gonna have lunch and we're gonna go shopping so yeah i don't know i just figured it'd be another good day to vlog i've really been watching liking um other people vlog in the car lately too i've been obsessed with like car vlogs so i don't know since i have such a long drive and i do have my tripod in my car today like installed i don't have to hold the camera out so i'm being completely safe i thought it'd be cool to just do another like vlog in the car but yeah i don't know i am in such a good mood today you guys and i really hope that radiates onto you and that you guys are having nothing but a productive successful awesome week i wanted to thank you for all the comments in my last vlog i mentioned super super briefly that i've been working on my boss babe academy and my new ebook regarding um it's called the ultimate guide to being a girl boss and just the response i got at how many of you are excited that i'm doing stuff like that and how many of you are going to support me and you're so ready to join and you like want more details makes me so flippin' happy. Like, you guys are just incredible. I talked, like, on Snapchat, uh, like, a week ago about being a little bit down lately because I've been putting so much work into my videos and I feel like my views lately have been low and I'm putting out really good energy and I don't really understand why, but I'm so, this week, I'm just not focusing on that. I'm focusing on the people who do watch are incredible. Those of you who keep coming back and supporting me, like, I have to focus on all the good and all the love because you guys are just incredible and I truly, truly love my job and I love you and I love doing this and I love my corny motivational rants and saying what it do. Like, that's just me. Like, my channel is... I don't know, it's really cool that it's not, I don't know, it's just like a, I can do whatever the hell I want on my channel, right? Nothing is like scripted, I can just be my corny ass self, I guess. The other day someone said on one of my videos um, that I was like acting too corny. I was like, girl, you must not have been around for a long time because I've been acting corny literally since day one. That's just my personality. But anywho, there we are again with the really long ramble. So this morning, I actually spent the morning with my ex. How weird, right? Okay, so... If you follow me on Twitter, you know that my old phone uh, was cracked. Then Christian just dropped it again and the cracks spread all throughout the phone. So I needed a new phone. So my ex-boyfriend actually works at Verizon. So I went to see him this morning. Not the ex who was married, the very recent ex. This guy, I, we dated like four years ago. Um, and we've always kept in really good contact. He has a daughter who's really good friends with my son. So they hang out all the time. He's still super nice and respectful to me. He, our relationship did not end badly. He was a great boyfriend and he's just super caring and like obviously at the beginning when we first broke up we were both like hurt and it was we were like angry and like a little you know a little sassy a little mean to each other but it's been like four years since that so we're like totally cool with each other and he works at Verizon so he was able to get me a discount to upgrade my phone so this is just the same case that you guys have seen because I guess the case from the iPhone 7 and 8 is the same case so I just used that I got a glass screen cover but I just went with the iPhone 8 and I did not need an iPhone 8 it wasn't like a necessity I'm not the type where like I like to spend my money on other things I guess um, I'm not the type where it's like a new iPhone comes out and I'm already pre-ordering it I could kind of care less what phone I have I mean obviously I need a good phone some type of iPhone for work because all my social media is on there but I don't need like uh, the iPhone X or anything crazy. So I just went with the iPhone 8 because it was the cheaper out of the two. But yeah, so he was there. He hooked me up on a little discount, got me everything I needed for my phone. So shout out to you, boo. Um, but yeah, it's cool. I really respect that he's still very like mature with me and just super nice and we know our kids love each other so there's no reason to be like rude or anything because nothing worked out and that was a really long time ago. We dated like four years ago. If you've been an OG on my channel, you might remember him. Um, but yeah, he's super cool. So anywho, let's get it poppin'. Let's start driving. I'm meeting my friend Justina today, um, at a shopping center, which is like almost an hour away. We're going to grab lunch. It's almost one. I haven't eaten anything. So we're going to grab lunch. Then we're going to walk around the shops and do like a little girl's day. I think I'm going to pick up some Christmas presents and... I don't know, maybe I should put on some music, but subscribe, like, all that jazz. I'm so appreciative that you're back here for another video. Please know that. And yeah, let's get driving because you know I'm already late.
The wind is insane today. Of course, the one time I come out and it's freezing, I have no jacket. We are deciding on what to eat. Um, there was a Mexican place and this other place called Woodland Ranch. Oh, it's freezing. So, okay, let me stop vlogging and figure out where she is. This is Justina, <laughs> my beautiful date. So what did you get? I just got chicken? a Santa Fe chicken sandwich. It actually looks fries. bomb. So I ended up just going to veggie sandwich, you guys. I'm pretty sure it's just like quinoa, black beans, veggie burger. Oh, mine looks so bomb. It does. So we're in Victoria's Secret looking for the bombshell leggings and Justina found these. Look how extra these are. Can you, I don't know if it's coming off on camera. These are like, holy shit, you want to be extra, Sparkly. make a statement in the gym. <laughs> would you really wear this? I really think I would. I don't think I would. I think these I look really nice. I really want to try them on just to Oh, see. that's what they're called, the knockout. Yeah, so they these, cute. they do look really cute on the model. Yeah. yeah. Cute. These are my favorite though. These are definitely a dupe for the Lululemon Align. They're called the knockout. And they're about 30 bucks cheaper than Lulu. I love the material of these. I wanted to find an olive green pair. Let's see green. <laughs> I could so see you rocking those in the gym. <laughs> All right, so I just got home from meeting Justina at the front door. I had a few packages, so I'm supposed to be going over to pick up Christian really quick, but I wanted to rip them open and see what was in there. So I just got this outfit from Laura's Boutique. I actually just posted a picture on Snap, so I figured I would show the vlog as well. It's just an um, olive two-piece. So I got it in a large. It's basically just like lace up here and lace up on the skirt which I love, so super, super good quality, like very, very thick. Um, I did purchase this, I don't like work with them or anything, so I would tell you if it was shit quality, but you know how like these skirts with Forever 21 are super thin, and like you can just tell they're not gonna last? This whole outfit when I took out of the package was heavy, like really good quality, so I love it. The only thing is, because I'm tall, the uh, skirt right here, like my, you can tell like where my legs come together, Cause you know, you girl got big thighs and like, it's just too short right here. So it's really cute for like an Instagram picture, but I pretty much have to cross my leg like this. I don't know if I could really like wear this out because it's just too short right here, but it is super, super cute. I pretty much just wanted it for social media anyways, to just take a picture. I'll definitely still see even like that. It looks cute. It's just, I don't know. It scares me cause it's so short. Um, the top is super cute. I'll wear like high waisted black jeans to cover my stomach, but I will definitely wear this top out. Uh, maybe the skirt as well, but as I continue to lose weight, especially like in my legs and my quads, I'm sure that I'll wear it. It's also a little short, but I think it was only like 40 bucks for the full two-piece set, and I really like it. So I just tried it on, posted on Snapchat, and I got a few questions, so I figured I would show it in the vlog as well. And then as for today, you guys saw what I got, I think, right? I got a denim shirt at Charlotte Russe when I was out with Justina, and then on the way home... Um, the very last store was Victoria's Secret, which is right by where I parked my car So I ran in and got this pink shirt just for bed like super basic gray t-shirt I think I'm gonna throw this on right now. So Anywho, I can show you guys more details on like everything I ended up getting later But I need to change I'm actually just gonna wear this PJ shirt I need to change into this really quick and go get Christian. All right back home. Just picked up this little nugget mm -hmm. Missed you so much today. He just got a new watch and he's like obsessed. Are you gonna show him? Where are you going? Um Say hi. Hi. Hey guys. Hey guys. Say I'm back. I'm back. Can you say this? Look at mom. Look at mama. Say, what it do? What it do? What it do? What it do? I slay. <laughs> Did you guys hear that? He goes, I slay. You do slay, baby. I'll tell everyone. Everyone always likes to see you in the video. Whenever I put Christian in the video, none of the comments are about me. They're all just like, your kid is so cute. You just steal the show, dude. But yeah, it is seven or almost eight o'clock. So I just picked him up, um, my mom was watching him, and when I got home I had a few packages, so I figured we'd end off the vlog just opening a few packages, showing you guys what we got. So it looks like Makeup Forever sent over a few goodies, which is super sweet of them. I actually just got um, contacted by them, I wanna say like a week or two ago, about sending me over some stuff for PR, which was incredibly kind. I have never worked with them before, um, but I have tried some of their products. I've purchased their HD foundation a while back, and I think some of their blurring like face primers, but other than that, I'm excited to try stuff from the brand because I'm very new to it. So the representative's name was Nick, sent me a little handwritten card. So thank you so much for including me. It's just always really appreciated. This is what they sent over. Um, it's mostly face products. He told me they were doing a promo for holiday, releasing a lot of new face items. So I am familiar with these, the step one, step two equalizer primers and some shades of the HD foundation. So I will let you know um, how I like those. What is this? 
Ooh, they sent over the new HD stick foundation. I had actually been wanting to try this and just hadn't had the time to go into Sephora and pick my shade. So I'm excited to try that. And they sent over this little palette. What is this? Oh, nice. This reminds me of the NARS Compact. Um, so blush, bronzer, highlight, all in one. I didn't know they actually offered these. That's dope, and that looks super pretty. I like that the bronzer is not super, super dark because I do have lighter skin. Sometimes bronzer can look really muddy on me, and that's actually a really great travel size mirror. So excited to try that. So yeah, I just wanted to share with you guys that I got those. I'll keep you updated on like social media and stuff on how I'm liking the products and how they work for my skin type. And then I got my Black Friday order in from Bath & Body Works. This was, I believe it's just six candles because it was purchase three. Can you guys hear that? Christian's playing his um, Legos right here behind the camera. So this is the only time of year I really like buy candles from them because it was buy three, get three free for Black Friday. So, so yeah, I'll find a knife really quick and bust this open and I'll show you guys the scents I got. All right, so that was a bitch to open. Every candle from them is like packed in there so tight. For some reason, my camera only has 2% battery left, so I'm not gonna open all of those to show you guys, but this is the first one that I opened. It's just pumpkin apple. It smells bomb. Um, I also know that I got two Winter Wonderland, and I'm not sure what the rest are, but if you care about like the scents I bought, I'll show it on Snapchat or something, but I wanna end this vlog here because my camera is now down to 1%. So thank you so much for watching. I've been loving vlogging lately. If you stayed till the end, I'm so extremely appreciative. Please remember to just subscribe and like this video I have a huge giveaway coming so make sure your notifications are on um, also my ebook is still half off it's only half off for December so be sure to snag it at that more affordable rate while you can and follow all of my social media so you know when I put up those giveaways this next week okay my camera is like literally gonna die me and Christian love you so much thanks for watching I appreciate you guys I love you you're literally my everything besides my son and I like can't even put it into words so happy holidays love you see you in the next vlog Mwah.